What's up, everybody? It's Glenn Sobel here on the Alice Cooper Tour. We're in Birmingham, England today, and we're here hanging with Rhythm Magazine. We're doing a little rundown of the kit. We're going to have some fun. We're playing the show tonight. we got the New York Dolls playing with us, so it's going to be a good night of rock and roll, and I'm just happy to have everybody, Richard from Rhythm, with us here today. Check out the magazine. It's great. Maypex Saturn, that's what I've been playing since the start of this tour. And what they set me up with... Two bass drums, 22 by 18. We've got a flying 10. You gotta love that. That took a little bit of getting used to. But this gig needs a wide array of tom sizes, so 10 down to 18. We've got 10, 12, 13, 16, 18. I got the 16 on the left. Make things a little more interesting. We got the blade snare drum. This is a great snare Mapex has been making. It's a steel 5.5 by 14 drum. And uh, it's the same version as the machete, which is uh, an inch oh deeper. And we started out using the machete, now we're using the blade. We're just keeping it fresh, mixing it up. Uh, DW pedals, 9,000, 9,000 hi-hats, 9,000 uh, X-hat, and then cymbal Sabian, of course. We've got my favorite ride of all time, the Legacy, a 22-inch Legacy ride. It's perfect for this gig. It's got the wash, it's got the definition, it's got a good bell, so... It was the perfect ride for this gig, for the Alice Cooper gig. Uh, from left to right, crashes. What do we got? Paragon 18. We've got Paragon 20, an explosion crash. 20, 19 inch stage crash. We've got the Holy China, right? The Chad Smith Holy China, blessed by God. And then we've got an 18 inch high China on this side. Uh, we've got the, I just got these hats. So I switched to these HHX. What are they called again? There's so many HHXs. HHX Power Hats, I believe. They've been awesome for this gig. We've got a 10-inch AAX Splash, and we've got some 14-inch AA Metal X Hats. We put a lot of thought on this. Me and my, my drum tech, Mike Miller, we thought a lot about the kinds of sounds we needed for this gig. And Sabian and Apex were just awesome in working with us on this. And now we finally arrived at a sound that we really dig. So this is the kit. Oh, yeah, don't forget the cowbell. Right? The Minor Cowbell for Cold Ethel. That's uh, an Alice Cooper song that you cannot do without the cowbell. So, like I said, that's our setup. And drum heads, I almost forgot that. Toms on the tops, so we've got the Clear Emperors, Clear Ambassadors on the bottom, pretty standard. We've got the 14 inch coated Ambassador with Black Dot on the snare. We've got Power Stroke Threes on the batter side of the kicks. Uh, it was Mike's cool idea to put the ebony heads on the bottoms of the toms, actually. I I'm mistaken about the, the clear ambassadors. On the bottom of the toms, we've got the black ebony. It looks cool from the crowd. You can see up, you see these black drum heads, so aesthetically, it's really cool. These are some big-ass sticks. It's, uh, it's the biggest kind of stick I've ever used. It's the Metal X by Regal Tip. It's the biggest okay. sticks that they make short of marching sticks, the Quantum 7000 and 9000, which I used in high school marching band. But these make the drums just sound huge and fat. It really made a difference playing with these. If you're looking, if you're looking for a bigger, fatter sound, those are totally the kind of sticks I would suggest. So I've been with Regal Tip a long time, and I've never used these sticks until this tour, actually. But I'm glad they have them. Great stuff.